So if you're a content creator, you know how valuable a uh, friction monitor mount can be, especially when you have uh, a system that doesn't have an articulating screen like that of the Sony a7 III. So in this video, I wanna talk to you about the Vlogger. It's by Andy Sin, and it's a friction mount cold shoe adapter that is pretty awesome and has lived on my Sony a7 III with my Atomus Ninja 5 uh, since I've had it. Getting into the package, let's take a look at the friction mount right away. So it has this quick adaptable quarter 20 that fits really well on the Atomus Ninja V and it has this rubber mat here to kind of help prevent from slipping. I will say that it still slips and if you're making any pan adjustments to this friction mount you're going to want to grab it by the friction mount and make those adjustments. At the bottom of it it has a quarter 20 and the cold shoe adapter and it's a really nice grippable tightening system here. You're not gonna have any issues tightening it down. The one problem with this friction mount is that it is not toolless. So you need an Allen key to make any uh, adjustments to tension. I have it really tight because I don't want it falling down or sagging or anything like that. Uh, you're gonna make uh, tilt adjustments with these two on the sides of it. You make any pan, tightness adjustments with that Allen. So you're gonna need the tools that are included with this system as you purchase it. Um, Andy Sin included these, I'm not sure why, uh, but this is how they sent it to me. It's in an SD card thing, I don't know why. Uh, I think it may, probably should have ended up here, but it didn't come in that. Uh, this is a nice, really sturdy tool, uh, aluminum and it comes with a bunch of heads. Let's take it out and take a look at it. Now it's a really compact travel system that'll allow you to make adjustments to any of your camera gear. And then you get the Allen wrench itself. And then finally, as you've seen, you get this like water resistant case. I don't know why you would need it, but it's a nice little inclusion for the package that you get. So in the two months that I've been using this with my Atomus Ninja 5 and the Sony a7 III, I realize that this is probably the best affordable option when it comes to friction mounts for monitors on top of cameras that don't have articulating screens. So if you're in the market for one, at the time of this video, it is $40 and that will be linked in the description. That is my affiliate link, so shopping through that helps me out immensely uh, while costing you nothing to do so. So hit the links in the description if you're looking for current pricing and availability. Uh, well. That about does it for me in this one. If you like this video, please feel free to hit that thumbs up. If you didn't, you know what to do. Thank you for taking the time to watch. I am Tomas, and I will catch you in the next one.